Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we have a rather intriguing story to share with you. One that involves royalty, a billionaire and a wedding gift. So sit back, relax and let's dive into this fascinating tale. Before we get started, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on our latest content. Now let's get into it. In a surprising turn of events, Prince Andrew, the Duke of York, reportedly sold his wedding gift from Queen Elizabeth II to a Kazakh billionaire. Yes, you heard it right. The buyer was Keynes Rakishev, a Kazakhstani investor, during the time when Prince Andrew represented British business in Kazakhstan. The ultimate owner was later revealed to be billionaire oligarch Timur Kulibayev, son-in-law of longtime Kazakh leader and Putin associate. Now, let's take a step back and talk about the wedding gift in question. It was given to Prince Andrew and his then-wife, Sarah Ferguson, by the Queen on their wedding day in 1986. The wedding was a grand affair, with Sarah Ferguson stunning crowds in a silk ivory dress as she walked down the Westminster Abbey aisle to meet her prince in his naval uniform. Despite their divorce 10 years later, Ferguson has often referred to her wedding day as the best day of her life. But why is this sale raising eyebrows? Well, it's largely due to Prince Andrew's controversial past. The Duke of York has been embroiled in sex allegations due to his long-standing friendship with late financier and convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein. Prince Andrew has always denied any allegations of sexual contact with his accuser Virginia Giaffa or any knowledge of wrongdoing committed by Epstein. However, the sale of the royal wedding gift and Prince Andrew's connection with Epstein have cast a shadow over his reputation. Despite the controversy, Prince Andrew continues to maintain his innocence, stating that he had no contact with Epstein after his conviction in 2008, except for a meeting in December 2010 in New York to end their relationship. Yet, newly released court documents and emails suggest that Prince Andrew may have continued his relationship with Epstein after his sentencing. These revelations have further complicated the Duke's position and have led to increased scrutiny of his actions. In conclusion, the sale of Prince Andrew's wedding gift to a Kazakh billionaire has added another layer to the ongoing controversy surrounding the Duke of York. As the situation unfolds, it remains to be seen how these revelations will impact the royal family and Prince Andrew's position within it. That's all for today's video. We hope you found this story as intriguing as we did. Don't forget to like, share, and comment down below with your thoughts on this situation. And, of course, subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, take care and stay informed.